In a digital world, opening a bookshop may not seem like a good investment, but for one man, he's not worried about a changing industry. He's more worried about changing tides. That's because he's opened a shop in Venice and has to think about keeping his merchandise dry. Miranda Atty has his story. say many, many things uh, about the bookshop. Normally they like it, so they say, oh, I never see a bookshop like that. This is Liberia Aqua Alta, or the Library of High Water. It's located in the heart of Venice. And it's certainly unlike any bookshop I've been in before. In winter, Venice suffers from aqua alta, or periodic flooding. So if you ran a bookshop, how would you cope? Well, probably not as ingeniously as Luigi Frizzo. Instead of fighting the tide, he works with it. Books are stacked in gondolas and in bathtubs. So in case of flooding, well, everything floats. The gondola inside is uh, uh, not just because for, because it's nice, but I you saw also the bath and the other boat. Is because the high water come inside the shop, so to, to keep the books high, they don't get wet. And the gondola was a good idea with a place, a room especially. It's not easy to find a place where you can have a gondola in a room for a gondola. The gondola may be hard to miss, but it's not the only unique touch. There's a fire escape, but you better be able to swim. And there's also some rather unusual steps. I ask her to put down the, the wall because it's nice view, it's on canal on the other side, but uh, I spent a lot of money, they didn't let me. So I tried to put up some chairs, some, but it didn't work. And then I decided to make a book with uh, steps, with a book, because if you go up, you have a nice view from there. And I said, so the people, original, but the people can go up and see the view, but I didn't realize they love a motor. <laughs> The stairs stand the view. The steps are made of old encyclopedias that no one reads anymore. And what about the other books in the shop? 60% of them are new, ranging from books on Venice and design to bestsellers and children's tales. There are calendars and masks, magnets, and postcards, and a couple of furry friends. Frizzo's bookstore may be full to bursting with interesting books, but what really stands out is its character. Miranda Atti, TRT World, Venice.